Hello everyone. In this new video series, I will show you how to develop a database project. For this series, we will be developing a kindergarten management system. Let me show you a quick demo of how the project will look like. First, we have the login page. Once you log in, you get a small pop-up say which says login successful and then you will be redirected to the home page of the kindergarten database management system. Here we have three different options, children details, teacher details and kindergarten details. First in children details, we can register a new child or uh, deregister a child, we can also update the details of an existing child and we can view all the children in the kindergarten. First, let's try to register a new child. As you can see over here, uh, these are already the registered children in the database. Now let's register a child. I'll give the name B or date of birth of May 5th and address as myself. Admission number just give some random number and I will, uh, he needs to get registered to the lower kindergarten and I'll set the registration date to today now click on register record added the record has been added to the database and now if you want to make any changes to an existing record just click on the record you need to change and then you can make the changes and click on update the details will be updated now we can also deregister a child just choose the child you need to deregister and click on it and select delete the record will be deleted from the database similarly we can do it for the teacher details also click on register and give the details for the teacher. I'll give it teacher. Register. The record will be added. And if you want to make any changes, just click on the record and you can make the changes. Says invalid number. Okay, I have just enter uh, 11 digits. Okay, now the record has been changed. You can also view all the teachers in the database. And then finally, you can check the kindergarten details. <coughs> you can check the students in the lower kindergarten or in the upper kindergarten. And the timetable and subjects as set by you so this is the project we will be developing in this series this video series will be divided into several parts starting from the softwares i'll be using to develop this project going on to the developing of the java application and then we'll move on to the database part where we'll be working in mysql to create that database and then finally a link the Java application with the database. So this was the introduction to our project. Next I'll be uploading the softwares I'll be using for developing the project along with the installation tutorial. Thanks for watching. Like, share and subscribe for more videos.